Okay guys, um, so uh, I'm designing this video. I thought I'd show this to you. I thought this would be really cool. And I thought it'd be a way of me showing if you are interested in trying to get a green screen working, this works really well. Okay, so as I said before, when we were using HitFilm Express, uh, we went through the process of watching the video up to the point where the screen starts to drop. So you can see look, that I've watched it up and now I've cut it. So what I've done is I've used this tool here, which is the cutting tool, and then I've reverted back to this. So this now, if I click on this bit, this is cut this side, and this is cut this side. So what I do now is because I've created so many video scenes, I scroll up, and I'm now going to put whatever I want to show on the green screen, which goes in front of the existing URL okay it's really important if you put it behind then it will just come up as a caption in front but we want it behind because what we're going to do then is we're going to use effort effects and then I'll show you how to do that okay guys so this is a bonus if you like where I'm showing you how to set up the green screen so what I'm going to do now is because this is a syndication that I'm using all right there's two things I can do here. I can either use my cutting tool, which is because this works really well, snipping tool, and then click on that. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to grab this like that. And I'm going to save that. Just going to put send. This is really quick. I'm going to do this quickly because I don't want to take up all of your time. And then what I'm going to do now is I'm going to import that picture. And I'm just going to go into quick access, click on there, open. And you'll see that this is the picture that I've just cut from here. So I'm going to move this across and I'm going to move this in front of the URL. It's really important to do it in front. And we're going to open this up like that. So what's going to happen is that if we go back, you'll see that this here has come up and that's showing me that this is superimposed at the back so if I hold on to this I can drag this out and then I can move this um, I've got to move it so if I click on this and then I can if I click on this I bring this forward so I can bring this down like that and I can move it so I can what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to put this onto my green screen so how I'm going to do that is quite cleverly, we are going to go to effects and then we're going to type in search effects, we're going to put key and this now brings up our presets for our green screen and we want to double click on green screen All right, and then we literally left mouse click, hold that down, drag that across, put it onto the URL that we want that green screen to go and release. And what I've done now is I've released um, this lots of software, okay, onto here. So I can now duplicate and play with this. So I'm now going to hold on to this and move this back to about there. And I'm just going to move this about. So I'm just going to put this like that. And then what I'm going to do is if I click on here, I can move this up. And then if I move this back, so we just want to come down a bit to about there. And what I'm trying to do is I'm just trying to get it into the picture, which you can see I've done here. Okay. Now you can see there's a bit of blurring over here. So how we can overcome that is if we click on to, I think it's the gamma, hold on to the gamma and go back take it back a tiny fraction and what it's going to do is it's just going to neaten up this bit here all right so what we've done now is we've created the background and we can make it a bit neater now there's loads of things you can play around with there's the mat cleaner and there's the spill removal which you can use as well bear in mind that you know you can play around with this but what i tend to do is i leave everything all set up and then just move the gamma just back a fraction and that seems to set it up quite nicely. So now if I play this, now you can see that we're getting a little bit of distortion here, but that's just where if I pause it, that's what it really looks like. It's only because 
this is only a display which they're showing me, okay? So if we click on this, so you can see that that's, that's how I do it. And that is how I put something on the back of the green screen. And then what you do is you just gotta make sure, one, that you cut the actual thing first. So where this is all green screen, and then you just make sure that you cut your URL from here, because you'll see that you'll see that as it goes past this cutting point here, you see that you know it's still green. So that's what you do with that side, okay? And then always make sure that your picture that you want to superimpose on your green backing or blue backing is that you make sure it's in front of your video. So if this is video two, it has to be video one. Otherwise, it will just go as a background and it won't you won't get the same effect. Okay guys, so uh, that's that little bonus which I'm adding into um, adding into the product factory. Um, so that's just a little bonus there and hopefully that will help you. Cheers guys.